strength of the lion makes him king of beasts. And the great ruff of his mane is the mark of his power. Go on, Samson. The men of the desert know that the long flowing mane of the stallion is the mark of his power. And among my people, they say that the strongest ram has the heaviest wool. To clip the mark of his power, the field of his strength is gone. You've seen the eagle climb the sky. But pluck the two prime feathers from the tip of one wing. And the mighty eagle could no longer fly. The mark of his power is gone. The mark of his power. Saps. This is the mark of your power. It's your hair. If it were shorn from your head, I'd be as weak as any other man. You believe that this great god of yours has given you your power through your hair? You do believe that, don't you? From the beginning, my mother taught me so. Your power is in your hair. What a beautiful power it is. <laughs> Look how it curls around my fingers. Black as a raven's wing. And wild as a storm. Shall I pull it out and steal your power? You cannot steal what's yours already. Upon you. I'll go out against them. Out. What is there, Captain? <laughs> the lion of Dan is torn <laughs> like a sheep. A lion? <laughs> 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 a man? As clean as a new mown field. He must have used a sickle on the soft and the big thistles. <laughs> Delilah's plucked him like a chicken. I've taken away your strength, Samson. Your little Danite sparrow will nest alone. Steve gutter rat. <laughs> Throw your spears. The shield of my God is gone from me. What do you fear? My blood will flow as red as yours. All Gaza will honor the man who brings back my head. We're not going to kill you, Samson. You Danites need a living reminder of the price of revolt. Find him. Call on your God, Samson. I've betrayed him. He would not hear me. Are you not stronger than a hundred men? You cannot carry away the gates of Gaza again. You cannot kill a lion now. You're weak as any other man. Stand him against that pole. Hashem, we leave for Gaza. You've done well, Delilah. No blade shall touch his skin. No drop of his blood shall be shed. Courier, take word to the Lord of the Five Cities that Delilah has kept 